The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. I can't believe Miz has basically removed you and the WWE Universal Championship from WrestleMania. I can. Have you not been paying attention to anything he's done in the last 20 years? Fair point. I should have seen it coming after he had you relegated to dark matches. Hey, on a positive note, dark matches mean I'm done early, which means less time around the Miz. So, sort of a win. How are you going to fix this, though? You can't just give up and let Miz have his way. No, I'll never give up. And I've been thinking about it. When it comes to Miz and Logan Paul, you gotta hit him where it hurts the most. Their egos. Well, Miz won't shut up about his big announcement on SmackDown of Logan Paul's opponent for WrestleMania. Maybe there's something there. Yeah, I think so. I'm going to need your suit size.
It's the moment we've all been waiting for. SmackDown's GM, The Miz, is here to announce Logan Paul's WrestleMania opponent. That's not Miz. And that's not Logan Paul. This is a circus. I'm losing respect for these two on so many levels. Sure, our WWE Universal Champion has had a tough stretch lately with The Miz, but much of that's been his own doing. And now to come out here and make a joke of our broadcast? I'm not on board with this. Are you done, Corey? What else is he supposed to do? The real champion has pretty much been banned from appearing on SmackDown by The Miz. I agree, Michael. Might as well have some fun with it. It's not funny, and it's not fun. Are you kidding me? Let's hear what The Miz and Logan Paul have to say. I'm sure it's going to be great. As your must-see GM of SmackDown, we are here to announce the multiversal, infinite, everlasting, supreme, bottomless, planetary champion's opponent at WrestleMania. And it's gonna be awful. That's right, Miz. And let's get to it. Because as your part-time champion, full-time piece of trash, everyone knows I can't stand being in a WWE ring any longer than I have to. So at WrestleMania, I'll be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the only thing that's bigger than my ego, my extreme lack of talent. Finally, the real Miz is here to put an end to this. Now, go! I was enjoying it, Corey. You would, Saxton. Miz's security team is going to have to forcefully remove the champion and Finn Balor. Or at least try to. This should be good. And no one is going to be searching for a tag in this one, guys. Everybody is legal at all times, which sets up a recipe for destruction. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. This match grinded him down a little. Face full of turnbuckle. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. Clearly had a strategy going on there with the attention on the leg. Down with a sling blade. Faceman drop kick. Oh. Up there. For broke. Oh wow, rendered unconscious. The official has to call it. And there he is, the man who's blazing his trail through WWE. Ladies and gentlemen, the Sultan. 
It's ridiculous the WWE Universal Champion, our real champion, has to win this tag match just to earn the right to compete at WrestleMania? There was a time that dinosaurs ruled the Earth, Saxton. Then humans showed up and the dinosaurs disappeared. In this case, the Dark Horse is the dinosaur. His time is up. Geological analogies aside, the fate of one of the main events of WrestleMania is at stake here. This is a huge match. The Miz at the complete mercy of his opponent. Yeah, Miz is having trouble fighting back. Harlem sidekick! Ow! Bam! Oof! Ouch! Up and down the hard way! Oh, oh, oh gosh! has made it his mission to dethrone the undisputed Universal Champion. Tonight, Dark Horse got revenge by cementing his spot at WrestleMania. This is just a small bump in the road to WrestleMania. Miz and Logan Paul will be just fine. Did you see what Miz said? Guess you got the deck stacked against you at WrestleMania. <laughs> What's new? I'll find a way to take care of business like I always do. Good, because I have no interest in going after the multiversal, infinite, everlasting, supreme, bottomless championship. Ha. <laughs> I promise. You won't have to. The following is scheduled for one fall. And his four, the multiversal infinite and the undisputed WWE Universal Championships. It's the WWE Universal Champion set to take his rightful place on the grandest stage of them all.
the dark horse will have to keep his focus and hope the Miz doesn't show up to pull any shenanigans at ringside. Those shenanigans got Miz this far. I can't imagine he's going to stop now. WrestleMania's night one main event begins right now. It's the Multiversal Infinite Champion. I have not gotten used to that one. Guys, this just hit me. This could be the last time we see the WWE Universal Championship defended at WrestleMania. Not just at WrestleMania, it could be the last time we ever see it defended. I'm all for nostalgia, but it might be time to usher in a new multiversal infinite era here tonight. Introducing first, from West Virginia, weighing in at 240 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, The Devil. And his opponent, from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds. The multiversal infinite champion, Logan Paul! It all comes down to this champion versus champion. After all the obstacles, the real champion, the WWE Universal Champion, is going to get his chance to beat Logan Paul, who's been parading around wearing the Miz's shiny fake belt. Cole, have you lost your mind? Miz is going to fire you. And don't say belt. Logan Paul's championship is a freaking belt. It's only good to hold his pants up, and it doesn't even do that well. There will be no debate after this match because only one of these championships will live on, while the other will be retired for good. Just never had a chance to block any of those. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. He is looking to unload on his opponent with that kendo stick. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. A calculated attack here against Logan. Paul has to wake up and fast. Oh, man. Oh, my God. And that definitely wasn't Logan's best effort. Man, just a multitude of strikes. Man, oh. right to the face. Just going all out with every blow. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. He is looking to do some serious harm. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Harlem sidekick. Nice. Uh-uh. No way. Ready. Shooting star press. The fight is being brought right to him. Yeah, he's got to surmount this storm coming at him. A uh, spine buster. Spear. 
Will this be enough? Close call. That was almost lights out. Getting him into the corner. And the knee. The champ not in a great place. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Oh, might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Off the turnbuckles. What's he going to do? We're going to finish it off. Swan turn bomb. Everything working against Logan Paul now. Heavy work being done to Logan Paul right now. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Landing on the outside. Spear! Ow! Bam! Oof. Up and down the hard way. Oh, oh, oh gosh! Here is your winner, and still the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, The Devil. He's done it. The Dark Horse has defeated Logan Paul, and the WWE Universal Championship will live on. Farewell, Multiversal Infinite Championship. We barely knew you. What a finish tonight won. Troy, so good to see you, man. You too, champ. Your big victory solidifying your status as the only champion on SmackDown has Miz in the most cheerful mood. Believe me, the whole team is delighted with you. Sarcasm for sarcasm. I dig it. What do you and our must-see general manager have for me now? A live interview on The Bump that you're already running late for. And believe me, you don't want to miss this. Oh, I won't. I've never been more eager to tell the WWE Universe all about the Miz's stellar leadership. Great. There's a car waiting outside. It's not a limo or an SUV. It's actually a compact rental car that you'll be driving yourself. And you owe us $74.38. And it will actually be more than that if you don't fill up the gas before you return it. Wow. You guys really know how to treat your champions. Thanks, Troy.
Some say the story was finally completed on night two of WrestleMania when Cody Rhodes won the World Heavyweight Championship at last. But it felt like a beginning to me, Kayla. I agree, Byron. But our guest at this time is also in the midst of an incredible story. Please welcome the man who won the main event on night one, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Welcome, champ. Huge night for you at WrestleMania. Thanks, Byron. First, congratulations to Cody. He's been in the hunt for a long time. From one champ to another, here's to you. As Cody begins his championship journey, yours is becoming a marathon. I remember right after you won the WWE Universal title, Roman Reigns joked that you wouldn't last a month. Now it is day 666, and ooh, uh, hope that's not bad luck for your upcoming match. Wait, do you know something I don't? What match? Uh, yes, it wasn't meant to come out that way, but we do have some significant news to share on that front. Way to blow our big reveal, Byron. Anyway, Miz gave us the exclusive on your next championship defense. Well, I'm here. Might as well say it. Before I do, just remember we're only the messengers. This is straight from the Miz. You will defend the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against five other superstars in an Elimination Chamber match. I think Miz's words were actually... I'll put the toughest opponents from his past inside a cage and see if he's lucky enough to survive. Ha, 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 ha. So, uh, thoughts? I'm not phased. Sure, this will be one of the greatest tests of my reign in the Elimination Chamber. And Miz can bring out all the heavy hitters he wants. But I'm not going to need luck. Luck isn't going to enter the picture. They used to call me the Dark Horse, but now the WWE Universe knows that I am a workhorse. I'm going to out-hustle every man in the chamber, and I'm going to walk out still the undisputed WWE Universal Champion because Miz sets him up, and I knock him down. So, anything else you want to cover? Uh, I think you made your point. Look at the smile. You look entirely too happy to be a general manager. I finally got the champion I should have had for quite some time. Cody, good for him. Good for the business. He's an amazing talent carrying quite the legacy. I'm proud of him. I get your relief. The World Heavyweight title gets passed around so much over on Raw that it must have been hard to keep track. Hopefully Cody can hang on to it for a while. Hopefully you can hold on to the WWE Universal Championship through the Elimination Chamber tonight. Miz has assembled quite the rogues gallery. Yeah, consisting mostly of guys I already beat. Overconfidence can blind one to unseen threats. I'm coming up on two years as WWE Universal Champion Regal. I think I've earned a little confidence at this point. Well, how you've changed. It would be interesting. What? If you get through the Elimination Chamber, perhaps Miz and I should start a conversation about the match everyone expected on your first night as champion. You versus Cody Rhodes. The match everyone expected me to lose? Bring it on. Wonder who the odds would favor this time. A fine question indeed. 
One that's been hanging over my head for a long time. I'm thinking maybe you're right. It's time we answered it. Maybe. But we'll talk more later. If you can survive tonight. Good luck. <laughs>